and welcome to uh, this tutorial section in this video section we are going to be learning how to design this chicken burger flyer so i'm expecting i'm going to minimize it leave it here so that we can be able to see what we are doing like get a picture of what we intend to do so that we do not lose focus so i'm straight away i'll go to the image so that i can be able to get my background the image that i want to use for my background is already stored on my local library so i'll go to from library okay i will look for it okay i found it so i'll go ahead and click on it okay so um guys that's it so um i'm going to be getting um some elements that um i would love to add to but first of all i'm going to get the table the table um element which um i'll be placing my burger on so okay i've gotten my table so i'll click on it okay so i'm going to hide this okay bring it right here okay then i'll lock it So next, I'll be getting my elements like I told you guys earlier on. If you have seen it. Okay. So I will drag it like this. Like this. Then I will lock it. I'll get another element. There are like um, three of them that um, I would love to use for this graphics design. Okay. So I'll drag it like this. Okay, I think it's too dry. And I'll go ahead and lock it. Then I'll get the next element. Okay, so I've gotten one of them. So I'll drag it. I'll drag it here, then I will copy it, then drag it again right here. Okay, let me go to rotate. Okay, bring it down here. Perfect. So I'll go ahead and lock the both of them. Then I'll go back to my gallery. And get another element that I would love to use. Okay, this is it. So I'll drag it over here. So guys, um, the next thing we have to do again is to get um, the burger itself, the flame behind the burger, and the phone mock-up behind it. 
So I'll go ahead and get it immediately. First I will eye this, then go get them. I have already stored everything on my mobile before starting to design them. So whichever one that I need, all I just have to do is I'm go to my storage and I'll pick them up. This is the flame. Place it right here. Just right here. Place it over here. So I'll lock it. I will take this right here, drop it over here, then increase it more. Okay, perfect. So I'll go ahead and I'll lock it again. Take this and I'll take it to the back, to back, to back. Okay, well, first of all, I need to take the flame to the back, so I will unlock it. Lock this in, then the flame to back. Perfect. So I'm going to lock the flame again. So um, let's check the picture here to know what next we are expected to do. Okay, so um, this is where we start adding our our test. So right now I'm going to start adding our test. So I'll lock this again, or let me just leave it here. Then I'll go to the test area. Okay, so I'll type delicious chicken. I'll bring it down here. Then I'll go to font. Okay, this is the font that I want. Ma'am. Okay. Then I'll go to size. Increase it like this. Okay, I'll go to style. Make it bold. Then I'll leave it right here. Then I'll copy this. Edit this. Burger. Burger. Okay. Go to size. Go to front. Well, let me use the same mem front. Okay, then I'll go to size right now. I will increase it. Increase it. Go to position. Okay, perfect. Then I'll go to test again. And I'll write 
order now. Bring it down here. Go to shape. Okay, the shape is okay. Go to radius. Reduce it. Reduce it. Then take it back. Then change the color of this one to black. Black. Change the font. Okay. Okay. Go to size. Reduce the size. Increase it by one. Position. Okay, then I will. I want to increase the radius of this. Different. Different. Perfect. Okay, so uh, we we'll go ahead and add the website www dot rest dot com. Then I will go to size. Okay. This is perfect. So I will copy this, edit it, and oh god, I made a mistake. Okay, I'll say info at olifood.com then I'll bring it down here leave it like this leave it right here perfect okay, let me bring it down a little perfect so guys <laughs> Be so perfect, like very, very perfect. So, I'm going to go ahead and yeah, I this. So, guys, I'm look at what we have been able to do. We've been able to do powerfully well. So, um, remaining this right now. So, all you just have to do now is um, go to save as PNG Ultra, then you save it. Then after you've saved it, you, after you are sure that it has been saved to your local library, all you all you just have to do now is you come back here, unlock this, then bring it out, bring it out to front, then go to texture. Go to your storage and find the place where you've saved it and okay find the place where you've saved it and click on it like this okay 
so what we have to do now is um go to texture and try to edit it very well okay i want to do something right now i think i've made a mistake i'll delete it then i'll go again okay now i want to be uh, more deliberate on what i want to show on the phone so this is the main thing that i want to show on the phone so i'll click here okay let's see how that goes Okay, I didn't get what I want again, so I'll do it again. Okay, guys, um, this is perfect right now. So all I just have to do now is um increase it. Okay. Then increase it. Then to back to back. Okay, I'll leave it like this. Perfect. Then I'll come over here and I'll, I'm going to lock it. Then unlock the flame so that I can be able to walk on the flame. Yes, perfect. I want the flame to be increased to front, to back. Perfect. Okay, this is perfect. Then I'll come back here and I will look at the flame. So I'll lock it again. So guys, look at what we have been able to do. We've been able to do so much, so well. It came out um exactly the same way it looked in the picture. I hope that you guys have been able to learn so much. Now, like the English man said, practice makes perfect. Don't just watch it and and <laughs> and claim that you already know it. Try it out. If you need the resources that I used, you can always send me a message on WhatsApp. I will send it to you as document. Okay. So, guys, thank you for joining me in today's tutorial video. Thank you very much.